much for visiting us here in this school. In behalf of Sir Martin B. Powell Jr., our school head and staff teachers, uh, we welcome you all here in this institution. Thank you for visiting us and God bless. Mabuhay! Yeah. Basag Elementary School where I grew up and uh, my, uh, my, my school back in the days, in my elementary school. Um, we're just thankful that we were able to meet the teachers and the family that we sponsored and the kids that goes to the school and we're just happy to see them all. Thank you. Mm -hmm. This concludes the um the day as far as uh, going out to the, the Sod School, giving the donations. I don't know if any, well, there's photos taken, but it was definitely a great opportunity to meet children such as the ones over here who will be on camera probably later. And just, uh, you know, just thank God for all that is possible in life and to make, you, make us think what's truly important. I mean, not only learning as far as our ABCs, but also here you have a school that allows God to be spoken, the, the parables to be spoken, stories of the Bible to be spoken. So it's, and this is a, this is not a, a, a private school, this is a public school. So it makes you think, when you see the little children, as the ones that are uh, in, behind Eddie, who are smiling, giggling, and laughing, you know, when, when you see that smile, and even though they don't have much, um, and here we have more, and just the, it's, 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 I would say it's, unless you experience it, it's hard to describe. It's the simple things in life that makes us, makes us remember what is important, not only to us in our lives, but, you know, what God is saying. You know, the, the material things, I mean, they, they can be nice, but truly what is important in life. You know, just being able to see a simple smile on people's lives, these children's faces, 
is the most important thing. So, but anyway, signing off, giving God thanks for all things. And I see you little ladies. <laughs> smile, smile, smile. <laughs> <laughs> They're in Bayugan City and I am the Red Station Manager of this uh, Advent Tepper. And uh, I'm working as a religious work in the past uh, ministry. And then uh, we go to other uh, barangays, other cities, club and evangelist. And then this time, together with two friends, and then inside uh, radio and to have a two hours in Advent Event. Okay, thank you. Advent Event 7 in the Bayugan City Advent Radio. I'm Pastor Dario Lucinara of Seventh-day Adventist under the banner of the Three Angels Message. Amen. We are preaching the Gospel of God. Uh So this afternoon I will introduce to you and I will give the time to our two visitors here in our in Advent Radio. Oh, pasensya na may soon nga nagmuritsing atong in English din eh basta kay importante nga ma-share na mo ni sinyo nga karon na una ang atong mga mensahe. I realize that we can't take the current our current situation and basically find out who God is or divine define who God is. One thing is God defines himself. And he, he really doesn't need man to define him. It's basically we as human beings, we as men and women, we need to go back to the scriptures to let God define who he is. And uh, one of the things that I realized as when I was going back to try to understand who is this God, that I, we also have to recognize that, that there is a counterfeit God out there. And if we don't recognize that there is the positive and the negative, you want to call it, or whatever you want to call it, we 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 have to acknowledge both that that, that there is a true God out there, and then there is a false uh, God, and that false God is basically causing people to worship according to men, you know, and not according to what God says that pleases Him. One of the things that I um, List, if you could, if you could turn to your book, the book of Revelations, for those who have their Bibles, um, the book of Revelation, book um, chapter 12. Pastor Ronin Bahiang who continuing effort to um, uh, materialize or to continue improving our radio station and thank you so much also the brethren who are continuing their support our radio station. This afternoon brothers and sisters uh, thank you everything and most especially thank you for our Heavenly Father who can be with us today and we're continuing to support our radio station. So this afternoon, thank you, thank you, thank you, and God bless every one of us.